All right, so one of the more frequent questions that I get is, what are my camera settings? And I, it's nothing that I hide, like I, I try to help everybody, but there is no special thing that I do. Like uh, people assume that I shoot manual and there's really only like 1% of the time that I shoot manual. And it's either when I'm shooting landscapes or when I'm going to be standing in a place for like an hour waiting for like the right moment and I need to know and I want the, perfect, the picture to be perfect, you know? But the majority of the time, I'm just walking around. I don't worry about settings, I just shoot. So I'm gonna tell you how I set up my camera to do just that. First of all, the aperture. Um, most people will automatically assume that I use like a really quick lens, like a 1.8 or 2.8 or 1.4 or something. And the truth is it doesn't, doesn't really matter because sometimes I use old film lenses and the lowest they go is like 5.6. Uh, this camera right now is actually fast. Fuji X100, the lowest it goes to is uh, F2. So what you want to do is, since you're shooting at night, open your aperture as wide as it goes. I don't care if it's f4, I don't care if it's f5.6, just open your aperture as low as it goes. And don't think you need some super fast lens to do what I do, because you don't, like I use my iPhone, you know. Next, ISO, I set it at automatic. You know, it might shock some people, but yes, I shoot automatic ISO and people, Think about it this way. Yes, you will get some noise, but no one's ever complained about the noise in my photos, you know? Uh, I think the only people who worry about those kind of small things like lens fringing and corners and some noise in the photo are like people on Reddit, you know? Like <laughs> they, just, they just take apart your picture. They don't pay attention to the photo. But people are looking at your picture. They're not looking at whether you have some noise in the shadows, you know? Like, who cares? I talked about the ISO which is automatic. I talked about the aperture, which should be like that. What about the shutter speed? Shutter speed is also automatic. So I don't worry about my shutter speed when I'm shooting. Of course, there, it's good to know like your manual settings because sometimes you might want to take a photo and it's not coming out the way you want it. But like that's like 1% of the time, you know? Uh, like I said, I only worry about that if I'm shooting with a tripod which I don't do most of the time when I'm using street photography. That's mostly like a landscape kind of thing. So aperture, as open as it goes. Shutter speed should be automatic. ISO should also be automatic. So basically I'm shooting automatic the whole time. And the camera is in aperture priority. So I let the camera decide uh, what I, the settings. You know, basically it excites the exposure by itself. One thing that I do do different is I like to underexpose, you know. So your camera uses, it, it decides what the exposure for your picture is going to be when you're shooting all automatic, right? But I like to use exposure compensation to tell the camera that whatever you think should be the right picture, I want you to take it one stop lower and underexpose. So that way I never have to worry about my highlights being overblown. I just keep my camera underexposed by one stop. And like I said, that's just saying the camera shoot darker than what you think is the proper exposure. So those are my settings for the camera. And uh, yeah, basically I just shoot, stop worrying about the settings. Camera's pretty good and good luck. That's all.